This is not coming off now. So what I'm doing is uh, after the screws, the self-tapping screws we use to uh, hold this thing down, uh, they just weren't strong enough that I, I didn't feel comfortable with them. And so instead of continuing using those, even though we used a great deal of them, um, I went with uh, a lag screw like this, but I have to pre-drill it because it's not self-tapping. But these things are getting a, an incredible grip on the metal. And then we're adding a washer to that and it's really pulling it down. And the, the pre-drill is even smaller than the shank of the screw. So the grip of this is an, like incredibly a lot. So do that. and then that will never pull off. The board would have to catastrophically fail before this came out, which we hope doesn't happen. <laughs> There's eight of these per, uh, per sheet, so the chances of it failing are very, very tiny. But there's 80 of them, and that's a lot. So we're gonna be up here for a while. Yes. We're also gonna put another coat of our decking over this. Uh, I'm sorry, paint. So that will... They'll be covered and smothered. Yeah, pretty much. Satisfying hitting metal every time there. Good. <laughs> well, the reason it works so good is this is what I use to make it. So, this is exactly the same stick. Yeah. And so it paid off. It makes perfect sense. Yeah. Ready? Take a look, it's on a stick. Michael's story stick. Michael's, Michael's story stick. stick. Here we go again. My can build anything. <laughs> well, you definitely got started laying out on the screws and then I just petered out. Me? <laughs> yeah. I got them all ready. That's true. You did a hell of a job there. Because I can screw anything. <laughs> what? Oh, my can what? screw anything. <laughs> The drilling rainbow. Remember when we used this to center all the pieces of metal? Yep. This is why I'm using it now. It was the perfect idea. You were like, I know. I thought about it long before this. I You're thought about when I was building it. Oh, really? The story stick was going to be used over and over again. Yeah, it's like your, your secret treasure map. It is. X marks the spot. You hear that, princess? Those are the shrieking geese. They always grow louder when they're about to feed on human flesh. <laughs> God, I thought this was going to take all day. It's taking going a couple hours. so fast. If that. Very satisfying. Just knowing that this will never be an issue yeah. when we're driving. You know, I'm sorry I didn't use the higher grade plywood. Really? That's the only thing I'd say is yes. that this, there would have been no grain in this. It would have been perfectly smooth. Yeah, I, I have to be honest with you in saying I don't care. I'm perfectly happy with this. 
this is our place that we can go outside and not be in the dirt. It's our porch. So I'm totally okay with it. And you can always, you know, if we need to replace it in a couple of years from now, you can always go to the higher grade if you want. I am. There's a company called Aerotech that one of our subscribers actually pointed me at. And I'd never heard of it, but they, they make a wood that is, uh, it's made with a waterproof epoxy. It's extremely weather resistant to start with. And it, I guess they make it for um, people doing construction in areas that have a lot of rain because before you can put a roof on a house, you know, you got the, the plywood sheeting up there, but you're in Seattle now and it rains every week, every three days. And so um, it makes it so it can extend their construction time that they can just sheet it with this stuff, get it up there, and it come back later with the rest of the roof. Yeah, it's not going to be affected by the water. Gotcha. That's what we're using next time. It's probably substantially more expensive, but seeing that we're going to be living in a bus, it's going to it be would be like a one-time purchase, probably yeah. for the rest of this bus's it might. life. Considering you know? we're going to waterproof it after that. Yeah. So, and I don't know if we'll use this product or what product we'll use next time. I might try that over armor, whatever it's called. Last two. Yeah. So how many have left? We have three things left. So we so. put in 99 screws today. <laughs> how do we put in one wrong? Um, well, it could have been the box. There might have been an extra screw in the box. That could be, because they do it by weight. Yeah, I don't know. That's very possible. Okay, one more. Everyone, look at that. That looks good. Yes. All the little shinies down there. You suck last one really it wouldn't be Mike if he didn't run out of battery that's right and there we are dun, 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 dun. Set. look at that it actually feels like I would be walking on it and make weird noises They've, they're gone there'd be crackling noises here and there and now it's just solid Oh yeah, there's no like creaks of the wood or anything. Yeah, no, that's over with now. It's much better. Very cool. I like our deck. We should see how far our solar panels are going to go. Let's measure. Yeah. You want me to go measure a solar panel and come back? I'll get it. He's at it again, you guys. Climb the I'm not ladders. wearing flip-flops this time. Right, that's true. <laughs> which is more than we can say for me. However, it is November 24th and flip-flop weather, I do want to point out. Here, come over and grab that. Oh, sure. Ooh, it's really dirty. Dusty. Yeah. So. <gasps> we could put three across the back easily. Yep. A little space there for the next set. And then what is it? 26. 26. So that's going to be 26 times 6 is 156, right? She's so happy in the grass. You're so funny, you silly girl. She's crazy. You're crazy, kitty. Did somebody get in the catnip? Yeah. You're looking a little frisky, little Miss Frisky Kitty. She been huffing the catnip. Okay, hand me the cradle. Okay, I got it. Beautiful. Okay, can you tilt the tilt the AC back that way a little bit? Oh God, this height is so heavy. Whatever we paid for these DeWalt drill bits was so worth it. They're really good. That's part of it. Okay, now I gotta get back on the roof again. <laughs> Here we go.
it like four inches. That's it. That's it. Bring it this way into the gap. There it goes. There. Keep going. Okay, I see what's going on. I need my scribe mm -hmm. and the straight edge. That was short work for a super finder. That's right. Okay, that's good. There. Just hold it right there, pull it towards you. Pull the bolts. Are we going to get them out again? Yep. Okay. So now, uh, let's pull it out of here straight up. Cool. Take it down like the ladder. <laughs> and then we'll cradle it. Get it in the cradle. 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 <laughs> Yeah, I didn't think this would be like 400 times up and down the ladder today. <laughs> Little did you know. I'll throw in a left break the ladder every time I go up and down. Yes. I don't know, she was a little fluffy. You think? Yep. My girl's hotter than she ra. Okay. We gotta get this on here. Oh, but we need all the... Oh, hold on. Okay. No, 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 no. So we have to do first. We have to put the bolts in it first. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. What we need to do is this needs to go under this and in place. So lift that thing up off the ground so you can do it. Okay. I pull that side towards you. No, the, the rack. Now do this side. There's more, like all of it. Oh. Okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna get the bolts. What bang it with? Or? Yeah, it. Yeah. Now we're gonna pull that side that way. There you go. That's it. Now pound that thing again. Okay. Let's do the other side now. Oh, there's a gap. I know. So we are going to need longer bolts. We're going to need a bigger bolt. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Handy. Yeah. Handy Mike. All right. Make sure you put your washer on it. Okay, get this sissy lala bolt out of here. It can't take it. Can't take it. You can't stay. Pull it's on. loose, but there's nothing uh, whew, to grab onto. Put ow, that washer on. ow, ow, I just got a sliver of metal in me. Ow. Let's see if I can get it in or not. Okay, get a wrench on this one up here. Over here. Oh. Yeah. Give me a washer and a nut. I'm going to turn this thing a quarter turn at a time. It's taking forever. Okay. Well, now i got to get the air conditioning in here. All right, let me put this back down. Not in use right now. I know, huh? Whoa. <laughs> we are scaffolding free. Yeah. Pretty cool. The AC unit. Oh, there come your wrenches, and here comes the ratchet.
All right, you just didn't hit me in the head. That's the important part. Yep. Okay. Got a couple more bolts to do here. All right. And if you're nice to me, I'll make the ladder so you can get down. That would be wonderful. That looks really good. I know, huh? Okay, we're gonna have to go uh, the opposite direction with these bolts. So you're gonna put the big washer on the bolt, put it down in the, the hole. Take this one off? Yeah. Okay. Put this one on. Okay. Ah! No! Got it. Oh, the pump down, actually. <sighs> Golly, I can barely get my hand to maneuver in there. There, I got it. Okay, oh God, I it. Is it hard to reach? I need to push down the nut or the bolt too. Sure. Oh, that's good. Just a couple more seconds here. Almost got it. Got it. Okay. Got it. Can you get a wrench on yours? Owie, my thumb. Can you get a wrench on yours? I'm trying. There's a little already like three quarters of an inch underneath the nut to the roof. It's so perfectly done. Okay, what do you need? Are you waiting on me or just... Uh -oh. Just trying to get my nut started here. <laughs> trying to get your nut? All right, put a, put a wrench on it. It's on it. Come and just save me. Look at how beautiful that looks. You're beautiful! It is beautiful. It's the most beautiful ever. Everybody sing. All together now. <laughs> but look at how much it like reduced the skylining. We dropped it about six inches. At a glance, it looks like it's halfway down. Yeah. It looks so good and so streamlined and just so tight and tucked in there. Yeah, we did a good job this time. You did a very good mm. job. I like it when it comes together like that. A lot of touch yeah. of paint to do on it though. Scratch yeah. the jeebers out of it, getting it in there. That's small stuff though. Yep. The main thing is, it's done. It's done. And it's done nicely. You did good. All right, one step closer to living on the bus. It's time to turn this bus around. Whoa, stop, stop. The branch is like almost touching. Okay, now straighten your wheels and go just completely straight back for a minute. You better go check the back, make sure I'm not running okay. over anything. Bear move. Uh, talking about this ladder. It's been a long time coming and I'm tired of climbing the other ladder. So, it would be really nice to have this thing mounted. Is that right where it's supposed to be? Well, sort of. On one side, maybe, huh? So, now we draw our first hole. Whoops, one of them, we had a jumper. Did you see where it went? Um, no, I wasn't looking, but I'm sure I'll find it. Oh, it's right here. Was it a lock washer? Probably. First time with the ladder. Super easy. This stuff is a good idea and worth the effort. Was it really? Yeah. Okay, good. I'm like glad. This, like, look, I'm standing here. 
and now it's so easy to get to the first step and you got so much to hold on to here and so you're just like right into this really really nice actually it's super super good so we put on this sticky grip stuff but I don't know if you can see it but it's there trust me I can feel it Is this just temporary? I need bigger ones. Because uh, all it's doing right now is just grabbing onto that skin. And, not just, and we don't have any access to this from the other side. Oh. I thought I know one. All right, you want to try it? Step is so great. It is. It makes a huge okay. difference. All right, coming up. Can I do it with one hand? No shoes? Just kidding. I got shoes on. <laughs> there you go. Grab onto something. It's buff. It's like totally part of the bus. Yeah. So good. I got a ladder up here. I know, everything, everything but the railing. Yeah. There's only one job left to do on this deck project. The never ending project is about to come to an end. Maybe. Hopefully. <laughs> if we can get this railing attached. Yeah, I had it with this project. Well, if it goes as easily as the ladder just did, I think we will prevail. Well, this is nice. Look, to be able to step down with one foot and already be holding on. Yeah, so that's what made it nice. you don't feel like wobbly or anything as you get in position to go down. Yeah. This is so good. Oh, and then your hands just like slide around. Yeah, using the side to go up is better than using the rails to hold on to. So now we have to get these up there. And the only way to really do that is to lean it up against the front of the bus and then muscle it up. So you're going to have to put that camera on a tripod, probably over here. Think it'll work? I don't know, man. <laughs> it would take a miracle. Honestly, I don't know. I know. We're going to have to have that dumb waiter after all. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to spill a drink. No. Can we bring uh, some of those clamps up here? Mm. I'm going to catch it. It just needs to make sure it gets all the way to it. I just don't have, like, aim. There's zero aim going on when I throw. I throw like a girl. The washers. I thought so. So that just removed the need for us to uh, pretty much cut the ends off. Oh, the washer just spaces it out perfectly? Yep. I think you can find two 7 16 inch wrenches <laughs> in the, the wrench drawer. Okay, I'll see what I can do. 
Okay. Super Panda wins again. Set him up. Okay, throw him. Yeah. I better bring him up on the ladder. Awesome, thank you. How's it look? Looks great. Yeah, look at that. Wow. It looked like it was supposed to be like that. It's all came together with that rail. You got those screws? Yep. It's better than I thought. <laughs> it's so good. It's awesome. Because <laughs> it forever will be platform nine and three quarters. I can't believe we finally get to say this, but the deck is actually finished. You yeah. mean platform nine and three quarters? Platform nine and three quarters is all done. It's done! So done, finally. Ta-da! We had no idea when we started this that it would take 10 episodes to show the whole building of this deck. Well, it took 10 weeks, and we put out an episode every week. That's how long it took us to build this thing. And yeah. I was going into this thing in like two weeks, but I was off. Reality is really? often different. When you hear people say, if you're planning to do a build, it's probably going to take you twice as long and cost three times as much. We found that to be very accurate. Very accurate. <laughs> and I'm sorry if our videos have been really long lately, but we decided long ago not to have a Patreon account. So we just put all the footage up for everyone to see. But if you want to support our channel, you can always head over to Etsy and check out our new stickers. Thank you guys for watching. Click the subscribe button and click the like button. 